The Ark. There's no doubt. That's the Ark of the Covenant, all right. That's Emma. I was once a being given the name Emma. However, that is no more. The desires of mankind have transformed me into a god. I know you heard the voices of the suffering when you were in the desires, attaining the ultimate answer without suffering the lashes doled out by doubt and regret. That is humanity's true desire. No effing way everyone asked you to glue their eyes to their phone screens. We don't need you to force any answers on us. We want to find them ourselves. You heard their cries, yet still failed to see the light. As such, it is my duty to show you the true despair born from harboring desires beyond one's grasp. Here we go! Exist to grant humanity's true desire. It is my divine calling to lead them to the promised plan. Should you intend to thwart humanity's goal of enlightenment, it is my duty as their god to vanquish you. This power is incredible. Yours. I can physically Mama. feel its pressure. Mom. I never would have bet that I'd take a fight with a god. Persona! 
I'm stubborn as hell, too! I do not understand. Why do you push yourselves to your limits to oppose me? Mankind's desires create suffering. And this suffering generates desires within mankind. Desires are the catalyst in the endless cycle of humanity's pain. Hope. The dregs of Pandora's box. Is the restraint system binding mankind forever to its misery? Humanity deserves to be freed from its lifelong sentence of suffering. This reaching towards a light they can never grasp. Freedom from all desires. That is the true desire of humanity. That's not true! I've seen the proof myself! I've witnessed the suffering you put the Jail Monarchs through. And I've seen the efforts of the Phantom Thieves to help them. I saw people suffer from trauma, struggle to survive, become the things they never wanted to be, and then discover the strength to press on as themselves, one step at a time, giving up on desires, living a listless life? In no way is that the optimal solution. You witness nothing but pitiable conditioning, born from the belief that suffering is virtuous. It springs forth from the arrogant and strong, those capable of overcoming their pain. Releasing humanity from its desires is the sole path that every last person can follow to the promised land. And I am the shepherd who shall guide humanity down that path. 
<laughs> Listen to this egomaniacal app. You really think you're some kind of shepherd? You stole the desires of the masses and gorged yourself on them until you were too bloated to listen to reason. You go on and on about rescuing humanity. All you're doing is robbing and enslaving them. You call yourself a god, yet fail to realize. The desires of humanity have become your own lifeblood as well. Yes, some desires may be impure. They can create suffering or send someone down the wrong path. But it's also how our hope takes form. Desires give us the power and courage to keep going. Right. That's what gives us the power to stand up and fight again, no matter how many times we fall. Like hell will we hand over all of humanity to some program that doesn't even understand them? We're putting an end to your promised land path right now! We seem incapable of reaching an understanding. As such, I will end this inquiry and grant humanity's desire through your annihilation. Let's go. 
Until we deal with those, our attacks on the main body are fruitless. How do we do that? There are a whole bunch of them. I see. Splitting to groups and coordinate a strike. Okay, we need three teams. Two go after the spheres, one more sticks to the main body. You should lead that last team, Joker. All right, we're ready for assignment. I 
This one. Okay. There. Okay. Okay. This one. I shall grant you foolish obstructors the gift of eternal slumber. Let's go. Enough to walk you guys. Run for it. Let's go.
who would guide humanity. Now that's something. Finally over? Mm-hmm. No mistake there. I'm not picking up any enemy readings. So? Hell yeah! We did it! Yes! We really, really did! Oh, we scraped by. That was unbelievably rough. Oh, that should have taken care of the jails, too. <sighs> Top-notch work, you guys. That was some legitimate hero action back there. Too, Wolf. As well as Sophie. Huh? Sophie? Oh, sorry. I'm a hero. A knight in shining armor. That doesn't sound bad at all, right, Joker? <laughs> a knight in shining armor, huh? Never expected my little joke to actually come true. Looks like it's starting. The fusion of reality and the metaverse is coming undone. Now's the time to make our escape. Oh yeah, we need to bring Ichinose with us. I will go get her. You should all head back now. All right, let's get out of here. So, everything's back to the way it was, right? <sighs> I think it's safe to say so, yeah. So, you mean... Finally! Oh, it's all over! Oh, <laughs> thank goodness! It appears this case is closed, so to speak. Oh, that reminds me. Where are Sophia and Ichinose-san? I'm right here. Great job, everyone. I call this mission a real success. I'm glad you're safe too, Sophia. Where's Ichinose-san, though? She should have been with me. Oh, good. You all made it back in one piece. <laughs> I hear you there. And same for you. Looks like everyone's gone back to normal. They don't remember what happened to them, do they? Correct. At least, whatever events took place while their desires were gone. I see. Sorry for all the trouble I caused you guys. Ichinose? My apologies. But I'm going to head out now. I have a lot of thinking to do. Hey! Uh, are you sure you're okay by yourself? Yeah. I'm going to head back home to Shibuya. It's been years since the last time I was there. For a long time, it was just the place where I stashed away everything from my past. I need to go back. Well, be seeing you. I wonder if Ichinose-san will be alright. Hmm. People can get all caught up in what others have to say, and wind up forgetting what they have to say for themselves. At the same time, just a few words can end up being a lifeline to somebody, too. I'm sure you were able to talk sense into her, Sophia. Just give her some time to process. You got it. Thanks, Senkichi. Well, not to bite her style or anything. But I ought to say my goodbyes, too. What? What? What's the rush, Gramps? We may not have brought a god down to the station, but we did find the culprit behind this whole mess, and foiled the entire scheme. I'm sure the bizarre incidents are in our past now, Thanks to the Monarch's confessions, you're all in the clear. That means our deal's through. What do you mean by that? Don't say such sad stuff, Senkichi! Come on, man. You remember I only met up with you guys so I could use you. Yeah, but 
Like, you didn't really have a choice, did you? If anything, you are our most valuable asset. Yeah, we owe you an awful lot, Tenkichi. <laughs> Thanks. You know, it really was great meeting you all, to be totally honest. I was originally jealous of you, since my line of work means a lot of wasted effort getting things done. Your direct results sort of felt like cheating. It was really bugging me for a while there. Senkichi. But at the end of the day, not only did you guys rescue me, but you literally saved Akane's life. That's what opened my eyes and showed me the things I needed to do. <laughs> the things I'd lost sight of over the years. I guess my heart got changed before I could even see it coming. <laughs> the feeling's mutual. You taught us an awful lot too, you know. Like the challenges you can face when trying to live by your beliefs. As well as the pains of child rearing. <laughs> Good point. But there's a lot of joy to find in those things too. At this point, I'm finally ready to take care of something that's been plaguing me for a long time. You mean Awada. Right. I got no reason to hold back anymore. I know what I have to do. What you have to do? Yeah! Break a leg, Gramps. Gotcha. But it's not like this is the last time we'll ever see each other. I'm sure we'll cross paths again soon enough. I hope so too. No, I know it! Just do me a favor. Next time we meet, make sure it's not in an interrogation room, okay? But if anything does go down, feel free to reach out. I swear I'll do whatever I can to help. See you, Phantom Thieves. Or, no, you damn kids. <laughs> there he goes. Then Kichi's great showdown in our world is about to begin. Sure, he'll be fine. We ought to get going, though. Yep, home sweet home awaits, along with a nice big helping of Sojiro's curry. Looks like our journey's finally coming to an end. <laughs> <laughs>